The other factor that needs to be considered is, of course, the careers, particularly of Nick and Steph, because they both left the ABC to do this screenplay experiment, and they were wooed, and there were long discussions between them and Channel 7, and eventually the decision was made that they would leave, and there was a long, difficult process. It was very emotional, and especially um, Steph, because she made a public uh, explanation for it, that she wanted to make sure that her career kept advancing. She was worried that as soon as she got older and she became less TV uh, uh, pretty, then her career as a television uh, figure would disappear. And this was, this change of career was her way of ensuring that she would maintain a standing in television for the future. And so you could, you could sympathise with her. Like, she seemed to be making a reasonably good decision based on what she felt was the right move. And um, I'm totally in favour of her trying to find ways of uh, helping, helping maintain her career and making sure that she isn't disposed of in a violent and horrible manner like so many other women in television have been. So, you know, she did the right thing by her. And then you have Nick, who uh, has uh, continued to advance in his career over the last five years. Uh, keeps swapping shows. He was on The Roast, then he was on uh, Pocket, then he had made a few appearances on the actual Good Game show, and then he was on Screenplay. And so he keeps going up and up and up in his career. And uh, of course he uh, is married and he has a baby. And obviously he has to make a decision about how his career is going to be advancing forward. And uh, hopefully he makes a right decision uh, what is to do next. It would be terrible if he uh, decides to uh, sell out some of his principles and take up a position uh, within the corporate television bureaucracy and he stopped appearing on our screens because Nick is such a wonderful entertainer and it would be a real shame if we lost him.